wanted to uh, go on this journey had more to do with the, uh, the abuse of women and more importantly, abuse of children, young girls, underage. All of that is also what church is about. You know, it's the makeup of church that resonates in this story. And all he's done before and, and what he's at now sort of like uh, hunts him in a way. I thought it was an interesting concept to do a film in Thailand about an assassin uh, who uh, gets involved with warring tribes in the streets of Pat Pong. And I was pretty excited when Frank Demotini called me up and said, would you like to do a movie with Pracha Pinkal? Pracha is one of the top two or three directors in the country of Thailand. And since this movie takes place in Thailand, we always felt that it should be directed by a Thai director. Project is also well known because of Ambak and Tam Yang Goon and Chocolat as an action director with a tremendous amount of skill in the action genre. Bidding set and one, two, three, go! And through Chocolat also showed that he had the ability to tell a tale tastefully and to deal with issues. You know, you can tell that uh, Pracha can move the camera. He knows how to move, you know, and tell a story visually. One of the things that Prach is great, I mean, amazing in, in his in his films are um, various kinds of chases. Uh, and we have a little foot chase uh, at night through the streets of Bangkok uh, with Jaiman's character chasing me and, uh, you know, a little bit of combat and uh, it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Why are you running? I don't know why you're here. I just need a favor. Fuck you. This is crazy. Just get me out. I was excited coming here working with Pracha and uh, his taunt coordinator, Top. And every day I was training, and in the training itself was the heavy work. There's little or no digital effects involved in the way that the, the fights are, are delivered. And you can tell that. You can look at it and go, well, they didn't, <laughs> they couldn't have faked that, you know, that, that guy just hit the deck. <laughs> This is this is just Jaiman just giving me one one big punch right to the nose, um, and uh, obviously he knows how to hit. <laughs> hey, one more thing, right here. No! Oh, God! The relationship between Curdy and Jimmy is one that is really interesting, and you can see that they have a long and perhaps less than savory history together. Jimmy, uh, he's a double-edged sword, you know? I mean, I'm not quite sure if it's to be uh, entirely trusted. Well, I think one of the fun things about my character is that he's, you, you, I mean, he's always bullshitting. It's like everything that comes out of his mouth is bullshit, um, except when it's not. I won his name. And I want to know, who needed me in my underwear for this? The lighthearted side of the story, you know, is, uh, is Kevin. It definitely is Kevin. And without Kevin, it would be a very, <laughs> very sad story, I, I feel, you know. Jaiman is a fantastic actor, an actor that I've, you know, ad admired for many, many years. And we have a good time, you know. We have, we have a good time working together. <laughs>